first grade, um, I was able to get our learning packet three. So we are going to start today with day one of learning packet three. The title of our story is The New Kid. So Dylan was the new kid in class. He had moved to the city from a small town. Dylan sat with Camille and James at lunch. This school is different. It is big, Dylan said. There are so many kids here. My old school was small. It only had 50 kids. There are 500 kids here. That is different, Camille said. I had friends there, said Dylan. Now you have friends here, said James. That part is the same. So let me make this a little bit bigger here. When we go down to our next page, we are going to be circling um, the answer to the question. So who is Dylan? Is he the teacher or is he the new kid? He's going to be the new kid. So we're going to go ahead and circle that one. Oh, we don't want it to fill in. There we go. Where did Dylan move from? A big city or a small town? Let's see. Let's go back to our story. He had moved to the city from a small town. So from tells us where he was coming from. So where was he coming from? A small town. Good. So we're going to circle a small town. Good. How is Dylan's new school different from his old school? Is it bigger or is it smaller? Well, if you live in a small town, do you have a really big school where you have 500 kids? Or do you have a small school with only 50 kids? Right, so his old school was smaller. So this school is going to be bigger. So we're going to circle that one. Okay, question number four. You guys are doing great. How is Dylan's new school the same as his old school? There are animals at school, or he has friends at school. Do we have animals at school? No, but we do have friends, so let's go ahead and circle that. Now we're going to do our writing for the day. It says, when did Dylan sit with Camille and James? When do we sit with our friends? Let's go back to the story and see. Dylan sat with Camille and James at lunch. Good. So let's do this in a sentence. Dylan sat with Camille and James at lunch. Make sure your sentence has a capital letter and a period at the end. And then the last question, what did you learn from the new kid? What are some things that we learned? Well, how about that Schools can be different in how? How can schools be different in a city compared to a small town? How can they be different? So we could say, I learned that schools can be bigger or smaller. Dep depending on where you live, right? Because we learned that if you live in a city, your schools are going to be bigger, and if you live in a small town, your schools are going to be smaller. So here, what you're going to do is you're going to draw a picture of Dylan at his new school with his new friends, okay? So I'm not going to draw a picture here. I want to see your pictures, and I'm super excited to see them. So here's our math for the day. See, we're moving right along. Here's our math. We need to write how many shapes there are. So we're going to count one, two, three, Four. Okay, number two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excellent. So this is a pattern. Circle, triangle, circle, triangle, circle. What's going to come next? Good. Triangle. And this is also a pattern. Square, heart, square, heart. What's next? Square. Very good. So here you're going to draw three cookies. So I'm going to draw three circles because cookies are usually circles. And then I want you to decorate them, okay? And then five apples. So I'm going to draw a circle with a stem. 
circle, stem, circle, stem. That's three, four, and five. Draw a box around the first shape. So which one's first, this one or this one? Good, and we need to draw a box. So that's like a square. And draw a circle around the third shape. So one, two, three. This one's a circle. Okay, draw an X over the one that does not belong. Hmm, so let's look. This is a hat. This is a baseball hat. This is a shoe. And this is a snow hat. So which one is not like the others? Letter C. So we're going to draw an X there. And this one. Apple, pencil, sandwich, cheese. What is the difference here? It's going to be a pencil. Because pencils we can't eat. And we can eat pencils, sandwiches, and cheese. That's all that we have today. Um, if you have any questions at all, please feel free to ask at any time. I'm here to help. I miss you. Hopefully I'll see you soon.